for 500 years. And um, I was thinking, do these fools already have season two sort of planned out? No, right now we're just taking a break from the series. I think you should go immediately into, you know, at the least thinking about what the what's going to happen in season two. Okay, why? Are you gonna you can add stuff and we can work on to that, Alex. Huh? If you wanna add something, then go ahead. No, I'm just saying. Like, have you guys thought about anything yet? Because you guys kind of need to, um, you know, Red Dead. I mean, uh, GTA Six is gonna come out like in two years. Yeah. <laughs> this series lasted like a year. The GTA series? No, the San Andreas. No, <laughs> Red Dead Online. Mm-hmm. You should probably start working on season two. You don't want to keep them waiting that long. This isn't an anime. It doesn't have that much hype to keep them waiting that long. Eventually, well, look, gonna die. we can't even it. we can't do anything because there's no update. Story, the legend. Story. Like what? What the characters? Do you don't need a mission to do every time? I mean, I guess we'll think of something for season two. You guys gonna come up with something? You said you were gonna start writing scripts, you say? You're just like, I'm gonna finish next people. Uh, yeah. I will see, Alex. Maybe we'll see, Bug Lab Bar. When you say we'll see, we know that you ain't gonna do none. No, like, maybe I might do scripts, maybe not. You're probably not. Yeah. No, I'm stupid, but I'm right. Yeah, don't worry, me and Dom will plan everything out. Is it? Like, of course the quality has gotten up, I guess, but only by like 0.1% dude. Oh yeah? And like, the reason why it turned me off so much because you guys have such horrible grammar. I'm like, you guys need to do something about this, bro. Alright. We'll talk about it in the future. Right? I think in season two. Yeah, basically. No, bro. Can't keep doing this, man. Look, trust me. We'll do something, okay? We'll do it way before season GTA comes out, cause we're gonna end Red Dead Online once GTA Six comes out. Bro. That's dumb. So what you're saying is you're gonna take 500 years to start season to start production on season two, and then end it right with GTA 6 to line this shit out episode for GTA 6. No, look, Alec, look, we're, me and the boys are gonna work on Red Dead and GTA at the same time. No. Why not? That's so dumb. What's wrong with that? That is the stupidest shit I've ever heard. And the, the creator of my hero was able to work on season four and the movie. We could do the same. <laughs> what? Those were the animators and whatever. You know, there's a manga, right? That had all that planned well, out. Spoiler alert, me and Dom are making a manga for Red Dead. Let's go. Bro, I don't think you're taking this serious. <laughs> Alex, trust me, we, we are going to take the series seriously. Right now we're just vibing. Me and Dom are just playing Payday. You should start planning. We and will. Start writing things, writing notes down for episodes. We will, don't I like, we will. No, like, you have to do it ASAP, you know? Because you gotta, if you wanna make it good, you're gonna take time to make it right. You know, it doesn't, it takes like a year to animate an episode of Family Guy. Right. Alright, Alex. I got you. Yeah, I have you on speaker. Yeah, no, okay, well, if Dom really cares about the series, then you guys gotta start working on it more. Instead of just like, hey, man, I, I just recording. Yeah, Dom says he... Yeah, Dom says he... 
Oh, I forgot. Dom. No, I didn't. Never mind. Wait, Jeremiah, did you say we forgot something? Oh, why would why would Jeremiah say they forgot something if they didn't care about Dom? Hey, what's wrong with that? Uh, <laughs> yeah, we thought it's supposed to leave him to die, and they're like, I think we're forgetting someone. Why would Jeremiah say that it's supposed to be? No, you know, no, that's what he said. What do you mean? Oh, we forgot my horse. That's what he meant by someone. You know, a horse isn't someone. It's a something. Well, Jeremiah's a little bit on the on the. Dude, everything, the grammar is just a key part of you got, the word is you, very important. You gotta remember, Jeremiah's black and he's a slave and he's, he's pretty dumb. I don't remember this. You're racist. 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 Or, oh damn God. dumb, you horse is thick. <laughs> because we cut that out, dude. Bruh. You should literally hear how we record. They're like, damn dumb, you're getting me so horny. <laughs> Fucking clown, bro. Yeah, I, I know, because I was a young one. Like, well, that really was not necessary. Oh. Yeah, we got a young one here. Oh, I love young ones. Like, God damn, he's not even young. He's old as fuck. You can see the wrinkles on his face. Alex, listen, man. Look, we're not the best. I cut out, most, and I cut out the audio for the massacre because y'all are just saying some shit that was like that. Like, oh my God. Okay, dude, listen, just do what you gotta do to make it a good episode, do what you want, okay? We're not stopping you, okay? You're the creative genius when it comes to editing. Oh, but I'm not a creative genius when it comes to directing, because you're the genius behind directing. No, no, that's not what I mean. You're such a genius through all these episodes, because I know you directed. Yeah, me and Dom. What? I know you direct the episodes because I lived with you, or you lived with us when you were doing the GTA series. Yes, brother. Swear to God, y'all need me in there. I know, maybe when you work, you can buy the PS5, we can buy Red Dead Remastered. <laughs> mm. I'll probably yeah, buy it, to be honest. I just, I just buy a PS4, just a little, because I'm just gonna direct. I'm gonna be the man behind the directing. God damn, that blew up my ears. Man, season two is gonna be as garbo beans, as garbanzo beans as season one. That'll be fine, Alex, trust me. Mm -hmm. There wasn't right, y'all was just improvising. Which is not, y'all not, not good. Like Look, say, me and the boys are gonna make Payday the series. Yeah, but you don't worry the me all those episodes. But we're gonna do it better. Yeah, sure you are. Is that all oh, the you, gold? I'm like, oh, no! Oh, what's that? Ah! I'm gonna do. What? No, Wait, what did you say? I said for the Payday 2 remaster, the only thing that's gonna be different is Dom's voice. No, we're gonna I'm cut gonna the ep. Do the map. Oh, God, I'm dying. Oh, God, staring at us. Why are you hating on us, bro? Huh? Well, you guys freaking. You guys can't do this. Look, Alex. Game Listen, we only do the series for fun, dude. We're not like, yeah, we're trying to do it serious and all, but like, it's for fun at the end, dude. Yeah, 
We're not we're not movie stars. We're gay stars. I'm not supporting that. <laughs> Dom said I'm not supporting that. <laughs> <gasps> Wait, what? A, fuck, I'm down, Miggy. I need a, I need a medic, bro. Yeah, but still, if you wanna have fun, at least you gotta have a good outcome to the fucking episode. Like, goddamn. Yeah, we will. Trust me. You know, production will go faster if you have everything laid out and ready. Yeah, that is true. Don't worry, Alex. I'll keep that in mind. That was a good point. Season two is gonna be about. It's all gonna be about the story of Jeremiah, Lewis, and Michelangelo. Okay. We'll do that. Like one episode is gonna be a story of each character, so that's like three episodes right there. Okay. What is that bad? What's the point? I, mean, I don't know what to do. Oh yeah, oh, we can focus on this story. Oh my. Yeah, I never thought about that. You forgot that Luis was a spy? No. No, yeah, I just... I guess you forgot the ending of the series, too. Well, there's a lot of different endings. Well, actually, we're gonna make three alternative endings. Only one of them's oh, gonna be canon. Not shark outside, huh? Nothing. We're gonna have three alternative endings, but only one is gonna be canon. Why would you film out a little alternative endings then? Just to, uh, just... Oh, just to, you know, just three alternative endings. Just like, you, you like, we want to show the outcomes of what would happen. It's like what if endings, basically. There's going to be an ending where, um, Sebastian kills Michelangelo. There's going to be an ending where Sebastian dies and Michelangelo and the other guys win. And then the real ending is where Sebastian and Jeremiah team up to kill Lewis because Lewis killed me in the end. Um, come on, man. You can't, keep, you can't do Israel like this, bruh. I know. I know we have fans. <laughs> Israel, Israel and the other boys, they're just beta testers. They're not even excited about the series because you guys don't make it good enough. They just watch it when I watch it. And then they just like... Okay, Alex. You gotta make him catch the eye, bro. Don't worry, bro. You gotta make it out there. Israel, you don't disappoint Israel, Jubon. Yes. <laughs> Alright, brother. Can't disappoint. You gotta start. You gotta start thinking about what you're gonna do. Because if you're gonna plan this, if you're gonna plan this, it's gonna take as long as. Listen, you can take this vibing time. Probably, you can take this vibing time to plan out the series, everything in the season two. Or you can vibe and then shoot out episodes randomly. Wait, you what? Have a recording schedule. You know how useful that will be? If you have a recording schedule, you can get everyone on. Yeah, and we do have we do have a recording schedule. What is it? Whenever Manny's off, we can all record. That's the thing. You guys gotta have a schedule so Manny can work around it. You gotta set dates before Manny can set his dates. 
No, here's what, here's what we do. What we do is like, oh, we, I call Manny like, hey, when are you off? And he's like, oh, you're off that day? Okay, then we're going to record that day. That's when I let everybody know that we're going to record that day. No, but what I'm saying is that you're going to tell me. How about this? Like every Thursday or Friday, whatever it is, you guys take a day of work off to do the episode. Every Thursday, Friday or something like that. Or every two Thursdays and Fridays. Oh, Alex, you know, working, when you have a job, it's not that simple. You can't just decide when to have off. Well, look, we just, we, when we have time. You gotta suck your balls off. Oh, the Dom. Yeah, oh, it's the fucking. <laughs> the screen yeah. froze again, bro. No, I see. We're gonna lose all that shit again, bro. No. <laughs> Suspend. God damn it. Alright, Alice. Well, me and Dom are playing payday. No shit. You know what you guys should be doing? Planning out the series, putting it on paper. At least what it's gonna be about. Yes, brother. And each episode. Okay, Alex. Okay, dude. That's not. That's not a yes, sir. Uh, that's that sounds more like a yeah. Um, well, I'd rather just shit on episodes whenever we we'll, like. We'll, you know? No, trust me. We're gonna do it better. Is Don listening to this? Because I know Don will take this seriously. Yes, right. he's listening. You know, I'm gonna keep it real with you, Miguel. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Don't say. Saying... Okay, shut up, Alex. What the? Uh, I'm gonna keep it real with you, Miguel. Everything that Alex is saying is something that I wanted to try to get out for a long time, bro. I'm just saying that now. She's saying that what you're saying is what he's been trying to get out for a while now. Yeah. Why does he need talking to you about that? I mean, shit. I was just a, he's, he's speaking facts, bro. Like, I don't know. I feel like we should take him more seriously, bro. I've always wanted to. Manny, like that. I mean, <laughs> Don said that you're speaking facts and we need, we need to take it more serious. I know I'm spitting straight facts. Hold up. I hate Hold up, Alex. to watch about Dom. over 30 minutes of the footage of you guys, like, just shooting out, like, random stuff. Unplanned. Your story, your timeline makes no sense. I, did you make the timeline? Did you make a paper timeline that I told you to make? No, because I can't. I'm, oh, Dom's here, so we can. Oh, by the way, Dom, you know how last time we had to quit on on payday? Yeah. We could have just suspended it. Would've, we would have been fine, bro. Nice. Because I just did that. I suspended it, and we can still continue. <laughs> Fuck, man. Dude, we could have been like, oh my gosh. <laughs> Join back, Dom. Okay, what are you saying, Alex? Bro, did you make the timeline? No, you didn't. All right, Dom. Let's 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 turn on the the timeline. Okay. No, write it down, cause obviously this shit ain't made no sense. Here's the timeline. Okay, so where do you want to start, Alex? The beginning. From the very first Red Dead start, uh, the first episode. Uh huh. Oh well, there's nothing big about it. It starts off. No, no, there's really nothing huge about the the first three episodes are kind of lame. Okay, so it starts off with uh, Sebastian Wright escaping from a failed assassination attempt, and while he's being chased down, he sees a another man. He sees a young one, Michelangelo. He's just minding his own business, and my Michelangelo sees he's uh, Don's being chased down. By, you know, bounty hunters. He decides to help out Sebastian. And then they both escape. And, you know. And then they both start hitting it off from there, right? They start doing little jobs. Little side normal jobs. But then, like, that's not enough. So, I think on episode 2. They robbed the train, right? That's what we did, right, Dom? In episode two. Yeah. We yeah. robbed. Yeah, Anybody they robbed. Good luck. But, yeah, they robbed the train, but the train is. What's up, man? No. <laughs> they robbed a train, but like the train is 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 horrible because there's nobody there, and there was nothing on the train except a map, a treasure map that Dom found. But you know, 
he he lets Michelangelo know at the end of the episode, like because he didn't think it was important until he told him. And then from there, episode two ends. Episode three starts with them finding the treasure. They find the treasure. They have some money. They get new weapons, new clothes. You know, they're doing good. And then they decide to go hunting. And while they're hunting, the deer runs into a freaking uh, 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 cotton field, a, you know, a, a field, right, on a rich mansion's property. And while they're running, trying to get the deer, there's a, a slave who escaped. He has a knife, a gun, a knife, a gun and a knife out. That slave is Jeremiah Phillips. You know, they talk to him. Jer uh, Michelangelo and Sebastian talk to Jeremiah. They tell him to join his team, their gang, and then they hit it off. You know, they get Jeremiah some new clothes and some new weapons. Okay, and then from there, what else did we do, Dom, after we got Jeremiah? After that, we do a few things. We, you know, we kill a bunch of people at a slave slave hideouts. Oh, yes. After that, what happens? Yeah, after that, they start killing... Um, you know, they go look for slave hunters because slave hunters are trying to capture Jeremiah. So they go out and kill camps. But Sebastian doesn't like that. We're just killing randomly because we're not trying to get attention. But because Sebastian is a pacifist. Because Sebastian is a pacifist. But Michelangelo wants to help Jeremiah out. And so he helps him out kill the slave hunters. Which is okay. But, but then later on, you know... Couple of days, a uh, couple of days later, they um, well, not a couple of days later, after they kill the um, the slave hunters, you know, they're chilling at camp, and then they go. We that's when we go to the bar, right, to celebrate. No, no, I remember, Dom. I remember after we got Jeremiah some new clothes, we were in the bar. Yeah. Oh yeah, I remember now. I remember now. So what actually? Okay, so after you know, okay, look, let me start over. So, you know, you know, they find Jeremiah escaped, you know, they help him out. And while they're escaping, they see a slave hideout, a, a slave hunter hideout. They take it out. Je you know, Sebastian doesn't like it. He's a pacifist. But uh, Michelangelo and Maya do it. They do that. And, you know, that's it, right? They just chill at camp. And then the next episode, they go to Valentine to get Jeremiah some new clothes and guns. And while they do that. They go back to the bar and celebrate. They start drinking, but they drink too much that they start beating the shit out of the people. Okay, the the uh, the, the uh, sheriffs are trying to uh, arrest us, you know. But everybody splits off. That's when uh, Sebastian meets Jeremiah at camp, and Michelangelo's not there yet. But they're just waiting. They think he's out hunting or something. But then, like a day passes, a, a t two a day or two a day pass. You know, they're waiting. A day passes, they're waiting, nothing. They decide to go look for him. It takes about two to three days to find Michelangelo because I... Uh, so they they went out looking for clues. What happened, uh, Dom? They were looking for clues. Oh yeah, they start asking the people in Valentine first. Yes. On the first day of their, um, on the first day of their uh, investigation, they ask people in Valentine, nothing. They don't find anything until find until the very last minute where Jeremiah comes in and tells them. Well, actually, before that happens, Dom is talking to a barber in the bar. Yeah. And then the some bar, guy tells them that, the, some guy tells them that they yeah, heard something about out. slave hunters, you know, taking out some guy and taking him to Mexico where he belongs, right? You know, and, you know, Sebastian takes us with a grain of salt, right? Because it's a rumor. But then Jeremiah said that there was some information about the slave hunters that took Michelangelo heading to, where was it, Tom? Uh, Armadillo. Yeah, Armadillo. They go to Armadillo. To, uh, to find out information. No, we go to Tumbleweed. No, we go to no, Armadillo. And when they're in Armadillo... Yeah. We see Dom's mom's killer. After some confrontation. And then they they try to confront the dude, but he just runs away to Tumbleweed. They chase him down. 
and then they don't find them in Tumbleweed. They keep asking for people where he's at. Until later on, they find this abandoned house with a bunch of dead bodies. One of them is Dominic's mother. I mean, Sebastian's Fucking mother. Dead. Yeah, she she is running away, but you know we it takes forever for the game to rot away. It takes like days, and like you know. Anyway, that's where we blew off her head off. Anyway, yeah, she's died, and then this the uh, killer is like, oh, you know, pointing his gun at Sebastian, telling him to tell his buddies to come in. You know, they're all aiming a gun at each other. But then the guy decides to commit a fake suicide, so he throws a. He's holding a TNT, but everybody runs out, right? But and at the date that the, the TNT blows up, everybody's fine. But the dude's escaping towards the mansion and tumbleweed. After there, Jeremiah, uh, not nah, Sebastian and Lou, Sebastian and the killer having a, a face off when Jeremiah. Oh, because Jeremiah has been hogtied. How do you hear? It? That's why you hear Maddie go. <laughs> anyway, yeah, that's happening. They're having a face-off. Jeremiah breaks out of his cut, breaks out of his, uh, breaks out of the knot, and he knocks uh, over the killer, ties him up, ties him up, and then they're all looking at him. Um, and then uh, Sebastian kills him, takes the killer's hat because the killer had Sebastian's father. His hat. He had his hat. So he took it back. And now that that's the end of that episode. And then... Oh, yeah. They, uh, since they confronted... Since they confronted the killer... The killer tells them about Michelangelo. And so once they're heading out to find them... They go to the bottom of like uh, the map for the San Luis River, basically, where they see an abandoned wagon, and then like uh, you know that's where you see my body on the freaking water. They take them. They take my body back to camp, and that's where it ends. Michelangelo wakes up. He's all scared, and but like he gets he he gets back his self conscious, so it's all good. Okay, the episode ends right there, right? And then yeah. after after that, um, what do we do? All, all I know is that Michelangelo from there starts going a little bit crazy because he got kidnapped. All right, but then we also find Luis. We also we talk about the job opportunity. About oh yeah, because after that, okay, yeah, thank you, Tom. So after that, we're trying to talk. We're we're finding about ways to make uh, a living, right? To make money. Well, we were talking about doing trading stuff, you know, collecting or bounty hunting. And then to Jeremiah was telling uh, Michelangelo about bounty hunting. And since uh, Michelangelo liked that idea more, they started doing it. Bounty hunting. You know, they were doing a couple jobs, you know. They were doing good. Until they met somebody. And, uh, no, no. So what happened was I went to the sheriff's office. I was getting myself ahead. They went to the sheriff's office to, uh, you know, get their bounty hunting stuff. But then they see a prisoner who's like, hey, I could uh, help you find better bounties than the ones on the posters. And we're like, and my client's like, oh, yeah, you know. And that, that guy is Lewis. You know, at first, Lewis isn't evil. He's clean, right? He's just a bounty hunter, right? Yeah. So, like, we break him out of prison. You know, we all escape. And then from there, we we do like a bounty, right? We just start doing a couple, uh, couple bounties, right, Dom? Yep. Dom, why are you level zero? What do you mean? Did you claim the rewards? Yeah, dude, because I... I thought that, um... <laughs> Hold up. Uh, let, me, let me claim mine. Okay, so they do bounties, right? I don't remember what bounties we did. But then, when we're doing bounties, we did a mission where there was a black guy, and it was Jeremiah's father. And Jeremiah was like, "Whoa, my dad!" Anyway, they did that, right? You know, they did the bounty. It's all good. Jeremiah killed his dad. They turned them in so they can get the reward. And uh, well. 
after that, uh, what else? What else happened? Let me look at the let me look at the titles so I can remember. Well, uh, that might advantage you, by the way. Yeah. Are you still following, Alex? Uh huh. Okay. Any questions so far? No. Okay. So look. So I remember. Okay. Episodes. Hmm. Yeah. Episode four is when. And know, episode five, they find me. Episode six is when we find Lewis. Yes, we find Lewis, right? Yes, and we break him out. <laughs> yeah, we break him out. But then we do this bounty. We do this bounty that basically was uh was terrible. It was a uh, it was bad because Michelangelo ends up getting shot. He gets shot in the eye. Sebastian takes his body somewhere so they can uh, cure him, right? So they can you know help him out. They put his Sebastian takes his body somewhere. Wow, he go and he leaves it somewhere. He lives in in, in tumbleweed and the mansion behind the port behind the mansion because nobody's there. It's abandoned. He leaves his body there because my grand is still alive. He leaves his body there. He goes back to help out Jeremiah and Lewis to get my, Jeremiah's father. They get him. You know, mission accomplished. Jeremiah killed his dad. He had his revenge because you know his father left him and his mom. They go back, Luis, uh, you know, they call back a couple minutes later. Luis tries to check on my body, and I'll survive, but, you know, I just lost my eye, so I got lucky, right? You know, that's what that, that happens, you know. They take my body back to camp to rest, and then all of a sudden, I get, I get taken, right, Dom? Yeah. Yeah, my body gets taken by uh, bounty hunters. Bounty hunters slash slave hunters, right? Yes. They take his body. They take my body. Everybody starts looking for me. You know, time goes by. Uh, let me try. I can't. I can't even remember what happened anymore. That was a long time ago. Hold up. I remember my body got taken away. Let me see. Difficulties with the sheriff, but we got out alive, and that's all that matters. That's what I can say. It's so fucking hot out here, bro. Let's go right up. Oh, yeah, okay, so, yeah, I get shot in the eye. Okay, and then from there, episode 8, bless you, bless you, episode 8, bless you. Bless you. Bless you. Oh, yeah, episode 8, basically, they start, they look for me, they're trying to find clues. And then they, they come across this, uh, this, uh, this, uh, this house right in the middle of the swamp there's dead bodies all over it and there's a uh, the the main the main bounty the main bounty hunter that you know was looking for me he's dead too his head is blown off everybody goes in to check and it's me i'm alive but i took the bounty's uh, eye patch so that's why i have that fancy eye patch because it's from the bounty hunter okay Huh? My pad. Yeah, that's why I have an iPad because it's from the bounty hunter that we killed. He's on the front porch. After that, see, they all go home. This is, and from here, it's Michelangelo's fucking crazy now because of the bullet hole in his eye. And he got, he got. What's up, Louis Tom? and Jeremiah manipulating him. Oh the yes. Oh, okay. Okay. Look. Louis. So let me. <clears throat> I think, okay, so, yeah. So, yeah, I'm crazy, right? Because I got shot. I got even more crazier. But then, to add to that, Jeremiah and Luis have decided to, you know, 
make me even crazier, right? But let me tell you this, Alex. Between episode 7 and 8, right? Between episode 7 and 8, that's when... That's when Lewis is confronted by the uh, Pinkertons to snitch us out. Okay? And while that's happening, Lewis tries to, uh, you know, motivate Jeremiah to join, but Jeremiah doesn't want to do it, but then he, last second, he does it, right? So, yeah, that's in between episode 7 and 8. Because in episode 8, you know, the rescue, uh, <coughs> To rescue Michelangelo. So, yeah, once they do that, you know, that, that's when they start, towards the end of episode 8, that's when they start to, like, you know, start manipulating, manipulating Michelangelo because they're already in the deal with the Pinkertons. Okay, we fast forward into a time, they were in the mountains, right? Episode 9 in the mountains, right? They're trying to hide away from the, from the craziness. You know, they're doing good until they get snitched out somehow, right? The bounty hunters find them, find everybody, and then they have to leave the mountains. Once they leave the mountains, they find camp. Okay. Once they find camp, um, everything's good. But then later on, once they're at camp, Jeremiah and Louis start talking about doing bank jobs or the Blackwater Massacre. Michelangelo is like, yeah, we can do both of those. And, you know, Sebastian is like, no, we can't do that. That's why in episode 10, they rob the bank. In episode 10, they rob the bank. Okay. You know, they do that. They rob the bank. Michelangelo sends out. Well, he runs away, right? Because he's trying to find, he's trying to, you know, find cover, right? <clears throat> And uh, Sebastian but, goes out. But when he runs away, he tells Jeremiah and Lewis to go get him, right? But as you saw, Jeremiah and Lewis were just playing with them and they just ran away. Because there was too many cops, right? So after that, you know, the episode ends. All of a sudden, okay, well, 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 while Sebastian was down, you know, the cops were, you know, there was cops all around them. They started to come in and, they, you know, they took him, right? And while they were taking him, Jeremiah, Lewis, and Michelangelo were escaping, you know? So while they're escaping, they're taking Sebastian to get tortured, right, immediately, so they can make him talk. Because they, they've been following the Arredondo gang for months now. And, you know, while they're escaping, Sebastian's getting taken to get ready to get tortured. Okay. And then, as that okay? Then when it's okay, <clears throat> Michelangelo and the other guys find new clothes. Right, it's nighttime, right? Well, it's nighttime. As you as you remember the other episode, wait, Don wakes up right in a wagon, and it's nighttime. At the same time, that's when they're getting new clothes, and Dom is about to get tortured. Okay. So yeah. They're getting new clothes. Oh, they already got the new clothes, so they're ready to head out. But it's nighttime. But they're still heading out to Blackwater. They're on the way. It's like a long road. But well, that's you know while they're traveling, that's when um, Sebastian is getting tortured. You wake up and <clears throat> later on, Dom wakes up. It's the morning, right? He's hanged upside down. While Dom is waking up upside down. Michelangelo and the boys have arrived at Blackwater. Once they arrive there, you know, they start killing people. And they start doing their thing. You know, while they're killing people, Sebastian has already been tortured. Um... He's already been no, they're still torturing him. But after um what's this shit? Once Michelangelo their gang leaves, they leave it's when they're leaving it's nighttime. They have an officer with them, if I remember correctly. It's nighttime. <clears throat> and while it's nighttime 
it's around that time is when they're taking Sebastian back to Saint Denis. You get me? Uh -huh. They're taking him to Saint Denis, and that's where you know he's in this. He's in jail now. And while he's in jail, he's just chilling there. And then um, Michelangelo and the boys are uh, you know riding out of town. Okay, they're right out of town, and it's already daytime, right? Uh -huh. so they start torturing the car to make him talk. Or oh, where they're taking Sebastian. And while they're torturing the cop. Uh, keep in mind that. They already had a plan, right? The Pickertons already had a plan of what they're going to do to Sebastian once they caught him, right? First hand. They, you know, they, they already had the three options out. But they probably knew he wasn't going to snitch him out. So they were going to take him to get Hank Scarberry, right? So they already knew what they were going to do with him just in case. So while they're getting tortured, I mean, while the cop is getting tortured, Dom is getting talked. They talk. The cops are talking to him. They're giving him the three options. He doesn't. He doesn't comply with them, so they take him outside. Right. And while that's happening, Jeremiah and Michelangelo and Louis are all. They find out what they're gonna do to Sebastian, right? Cause that's what they. That's what they're gonna do, right? That's what the Pickerton's had in mind. And since the Pickerton snitched them out, they know where to go now, where to find Sebastian, right? So they start heading down to Strawberry. So they go to Strawberry. They're chilling there. They're waiting. Uh, Jeremiah and Lewis stay there while Michelangelo goes back to camp. Okay. So Jeremiah and Lewis are chilling at Strawberry. While that's happening, <clears throat> um, Dom is already in the back of the of the of the of the of the, of the, of the prison place. He's in the back, like in the back. You know, that's when they're telling him the story. They're they're just chilling because when they're telling him when they're telling Dom the story. Um, let me see. I'm trying to think. So they're chilling, right? They're strawberry. <laughs> okay, they're strawberry, and you know the cops. The cops finished explaining the story to Dom. That's when it's nighttime. They're done telling the story. They put Dom in the wagon, and he starts heading to Strawberry. Well, they're heading to Strawberry. It's nighttime, but it's about to be morning, but it's still nighttime. Jeremiah and Luis have been waiting there the whole night, waiting for the the wagon. That's when they ambush the wagon. And that's when they get Sebastian, and then they take him back to camp. They let the uh, rookie go, because it's a new guy, a new cop. They let the rookie go, so they can tell the Pinkertons. But they trash his wagon, so they let him, they let him go running. Yeah, well, anyway, that happens. They take um, Sebastian back to camp. Um, everybody's all happy, you know. It's all good, but then, um, when they're celebrating, Sebastian takes Sebastian takes Michelangelo to talk with him right on the side, right, and he's telling him. Is it, I heard that, you know, there was this going on in Blackwater, three men. I was wondering, did, was that you guys that did that? And then that's when Michelangelo says, well, we had to. It was the only way to get you out. And then from there, Dom is all pissed that he did that, that they did that, that Michelangelo did that. They ride out, and he rides out. And while he's riding out, you know, cussing out, shit, 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 he meets the strange man. And that's where the, it ends. For now. What about season two? Season two? Well, let me give you a little thing. Because in season two, we might add moonshining. What's that? It's like, a, it's like a role in the game where you moonshine. Because yeah, I know what moonshining is because I asked you. It's, basically, it's illegal. Huh? It's illegal. What do you mean it's illegal? It's like it's a... Uh, 
Moonshining is illegal. It's like when you make your own alcohol. It's illegal. We might do a couple of that because you get a shack. A moonshine shack. Yeah, but season two right now, we haven't really talked about it, me and Dom. But I was thinking of adding the moonshining, possibly. What's the moonshine gonna add to the story? Dom just found out that y'all fools murked all, almost basically a bunch of people in Blackwater. And then she just left the mysterious man. Don't you think you should think about doing something like that? Instead of putting him on in the back burner, forgetting about it, shit out more episodes. Yeah, you're right. So I think. You know what's gonna happen in season two? Why? is going to be confronted by the strange man. Okay, Dom's gonna be Huh. What's gonna happen is... Well... Look, Alex, to be honest, I have no clue what's gonna happen in Season 2. I haven't, about it. I haven't thought about it, that's what we're gonna talk about it later. Listen, Alex, I don't know. <laughs> Look, I already told you the storyline. Season 2, we'll talk about it later. Right now... Um, me and Dom are trying to play Payday. You wa you wasted 47 minutes for us already. 47 minutes of discussing a series that you all really like, but apparently you don't. Yeah, we do. Do you have any questions about the storyline? Do you feel better? For season okay. one? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Well, now that you know the fucking timeline... How about you start working on talking about season two while playing? Alright, we will. Throw around ideas, write them down or something so we forget them. Alright, Alex, we will. Yeah, sure you will. Oh my god. Make sure he does. We will. Goodbye, Alex. Let us play now. Uh huh. Alright, thank you. Bye. 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 Jesus Christ, dude. Listen, Miguel, I agree with him, bro. We gotta start doing something. Yeah, bro. we gotta start thinking about season two. Like, for a long time, I've always wanted to take this series so seriously, but I always got caught up with y'all, and I just never really thought anything about it. What you do know? you mean? Like, every, I, I always wanted to be serious, you know? But, like, I always Look, noticed Dom, that you guys were me and you, Me and you are the only serious ones, bro. I don't know, dude. It's just we need more people, we need more. Oh my god, dude, honestly. I know like, we I need wanna, more. Mm -hmm. I want to do something with this series, bro. Like, I really do, but like, I just never talked about it like that because I always saw that you guys were having fun. I was just like, oh, why should I kill the mood, you know? But I, no, I, I want to be serious to be too, you know? I, I really do. I really want like a lot of views on it too, but like at the same time, I want to have fun with it as well, but it just feels yeah, like and we can't are. Do that, bro. We are having fun with it, you know? Yeah. But, like, oh, so yeah, let's try, not, let's try not to get caught. Yeah, let's try not to get caught. So. Yeah, we're trying to have fun with it, but, you know, we can't... Look, we can't stop Manny and Lewis from, you know, saying... We talk uh, shit. Yeah, know. <laughs> you know? Just let them be, dude. <laughs> but, um, yeah, like, I really do want to take this series seriously, but, you know, it's really difficult to do that when you have two jokesters, you know? It's fun, you know? Yeah, I mean, the series is, is not, wouldn't have been cool without them, because honestly, they're the reason why the series is kind of alive, because we added more people to it. And yeah, we need more people. More, yeah. more people, bro. But I don't think we can add any more, that's it, man. Of course, we'll have to do. It fucking sucks, dude. I know it does. But, uh, you know. We're just gonna have to deal with it. I guess so. Uh, hope we can find people soon, though, to be honest. Oh no. Oh, get down, get down. Mm 
Let's do this. So, yeah, season two, I don't know what's gonna happen. I don't know either, dude. How do you I, think it's, I don't know. Because, look, with Strange Man has appeared, Sebastian's gonna take stuff more serious because of the Strange Man. So his character's gonna, you know. I know, but I just, like, I'm I'm not good with uh, ideas, bro. Like, I'm fucking horrible trying to come up with shit like this, bro. Yeah, me too. I'm kind of horrible, too. I'm not original. Yeah. yeah. I don't know, dude. Like, I hate to admit it, but, like, some of the, you know, some of the ideas we take are, you know, we sample from the actual story mode of Red Dead. <laughs> no, you know it's, I mean? it's like, fine, you know. Yeah, but I want to I wanna get, you know, original, bro. I mean, some of the some of the content that we have is just literally sampled from like the actual storyline of our dude. Yeah, I understand. I'm just, I just, want, I hope we can find something soon, bro. We just, I, I can't think of anything to do. Wait, what the heck? What is that? What was that? Gotta shoot a thing, the rope. Oh, we landed in here. Yeah, I really don't know what season two is gonna have. Fuck, man. Fuck, man, hell, man. I wish I got more people. As much as anything, I want so much more people to the series, bro. I know, Mitch. Please, on the road, can people, like, join the series? Fuck, you know. Like, it's just gonna make the series better, and it's gonna give us more ideas, trust me. If we have more people, we'll just have more ideas, and, and more possibilities of do things, bro. More possibilities to have more ideas. Yeah. Where's the computer? I don't know, but... Gotta wait for the single. Open up. Alright, bro. Shit. Let's go. Oh, now that I know where the server room is, I'm gonna go plug it up. Oh, they were in the bottom floor. Dump cover is shut up. Fucking guy, bro. Fuck. I'm trying to find blanks. I know some of the location for tape. Oh, uh, blanks. Oh, fuck! No! Oh, I saw one on the roof, I think I remember. Oh, there's two. I'm out of bullets. Shit. I think I need to go more upstairs, huh? When are you gonna use your planks, brother? Uh, I don't know where else to put them. Just, you can put it over here. Come over here. Fuck. Put it here. 
是。哦。No piece of shit. Fucking do that, bro. I'm trying to find more plants. There we go. I know I do want to focus on like the backstories of the characters, but that's gonna be lame, don't you think? No, right? I don't know, bro. It's fucking complicated sometimes, you know? I know. Maybe if we're a part of a big game developing company. Yeah. They would know. Or they would know. Oh, fuck. Oh, Lord. Where are these cops coming from? Still alive, I don't know how. Oh, thank you. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna get the power. Congress, you fool! Oh shit, I gotta go. <gasps> I can't die. No, I'm a dad. Gotcha, bro. Alright, let's go. Alright, let's go.
Yeah, I don't have the wrong way. Ooh, Lord. Ooh, Lord. Ooh, Lord. Brother, where are you? Oh, good. Don't worry about me. Okay. Oh, God. Let's pull those right there. Fuck! Brother... No! I'm coming. This is shit! Oh fuck, I fell. I'm coming, don't you worry. You want a piece of me, piece of shit? No! Go, go, Alright, thank you, brother. Let's get the fuck out of here, come on. God damn! Let's go! Oh, I hate doing this mission like 10 times. I know, bro. Oh, you scared that means we don't get any of it. Oh. <laughs> it's so lame. You know... Well, it kind of be too late to be honest, but I, th you know, there was an idea that we never did for the series. What was it? Um, we talked about Michelangelo's brother, Sebastian. <laughs> Michelangelo's brother. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, like his brother Sebastian getting killed in that robbery. Remember that? Uh, what do you mean? Actually, I don't remember. Like, there was I we, there was an idea there was an idea that we had that um Michelangelo had a brother. Oh whose Sebastian. name was Sebastian. Yeah, his name was Sebastian yeah. I mean I don't know. I feel like it's a little too late to Oh that. we could, yeah we could. We could do that though, but in like some sort of way. Cause like a you know, you find a bounty and the bounty is the person the the name of the person who uh, killed your brother. Killed yeah. Sebastian. Your uh, Michelangelo, Michelangelo brother. Oh we shit! Could do something like that, yeah. Tony, stand back. I'm trying to look for the mobs. Can't find them. Oh, here's one. Wait, can you uh, disactivate it? Oh, I thought I could. <laughs> I thought I could uh, like, run it. Oh, Three more. Oh, here they are. That's two. Who's left? I can't find the other one. <laughs> Where are the monsters, dude? I think. Half of them are already done, it seems like a few more. Oh wait, I found them, in this room. Oh, there's nobody here. Dude, there's nobody here. What the fuck? They said there was three more, but I already killed one. But where are they? Wow. Alright. 
You know, I get a boost every time I get shot, like I'm about to die, I get a boost. Oh, really? That's a cool boost. Yeah. Get gas, get like gas. When like when I'm really low on health, I get a boost. That's, that's like a, right that's now, a pretty boost. good perk, I'd say. For sure. real? Very useful. I would have Yes. I heard a cloaker, bro. Thunderous! <gasps> Where the fucking gas, bro? I can't find any. It's, in, it's all in the gas station. Come look around. Let's see. Boost. Ah, god kinda, damn. Kind of boost. Oh, there you go. I couldn't pick that up last time. I know there was one more right here. Put gas, brother. You're the only one that hasn't. You're the one with the gas gun. I I have one. No way. Yes. Hey, I'm on the fucking. What the hell? There you go. That's lame, bro. We could have done a lot of grind spree if it didn't mess up. Honestly, dude. Oh, well. But now we know that we can suspend at any time. Right. We can uh, if suspend at any time. We'll be fine either way. Hopefully. They're down. Fuck. No. Hey, fuck you. No. Thank you, Sangros. Let's go. I'm gonna pick up this gas can, bro. We don't need it anymore. Alright. Oh, yeah, I like got a how soldier. I, find, I like how I find gas cans, even though we just don't even need it anymore, and there's like two of them at the same time. I got a soldier for him. I'm over. I already got a soldier. Or, I already got a. No, well, my bad. I was just trying to help. Arm. I'm sorry, bro. Fuck, man. I feel like a dick. Oh. 
Oh man, yeah, but I don't know. Oh wait, we gotta get the We gotta defend it. Oh, the captain is here. I don't give a fuck about the stupid ass captain. I kill him right now. Bitches. Where is he? Ass captain. Where is he? There he is. You serious? The captain is still alive. Piece of shit! Captain! It's all good. Ah! He's leaving. He's leaving. Let's go. I wanna ah! kill him. Ah, piece of shit! Yeah! Can I actually kill the captain? Yeah, you can kill him. Piece of fucking shit, come here. Stop fucking pushing me, bitch, come here. Bro, my king. There we go. We did it. Ah, I wanna kill you! Piece of shit! No, I don't have a saw. God. My game keeps freezing. God damn it, whatever. You are lucky, Captain. I don't think a crowbar. I don't think a crowbar was gonna work either way. <laughs> no. It should have, but no. <sighs> oh, we're <What> dumbass. <laughs> uh, it's easy. What do we need for? So what do we need? What are we looking at? He said Foggy Bob Okay, we see Varka Varka, take the barcode You got it I need a Oh, I need a crowbar, that's what I need I keep looking, keep opening stuff for Varka Varka, Varka, Varka. Varka, here's one for Varka. Thank you. Wasn't that like a weapon bag? Oh. Oh, there it is. They put it over there. I see. I got a barcode that I think I think that's the right one. If it's if it's be. a if it's a vodka box, then yeah. Yeah, have to be. All right, we did it. First try. Let's go. Oh man, we got lots of weapons. We gotta take. Never. We got that bag over there. Oh. Only two bags? Oh, they're carrying one. How? I don't know, but man, they're helping so, out. Only three, right? Oh fuck. Yeah, only two. Fuck. Yeah, only three. Yeah, let's go. I hope Sanger is gonna drop it, bro. He will. Oh, there's snipers. Who? Oh. 
Thank you. You're welcome. Okay. We gotta wake on Sangre. Oh god, I'm gonna go get him. He's slow. do the breakout and then after that I'm off. Alright. It's a shame that they glitched out. It really yeah, is. Yeah dude what about like fucking uh, 60 bro? I know bro. I know well. Hoxton got his nickname for being arrested in the district of Hoxton shot it to London. Interesting. Um, 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 shit, um, we'll start our names later. Anyway, I'm black. <laughs> Don't be like, you know, I poop. <laughs> oh, that fucking panther, you want us? <laughs> How did I not die from that? <gasps> what the fuck? <laughs> I got fucking cuffed, bro. Bro, <laughs> that's a first. Yeah, I don't remember how that happened to me before. I've seen it happen to me before, but like back in the days when I would be stealthing. Yeah, yeah that would happen to me. Yeah, it's kind of cool because it never happens a lot. Fuck, I'm trying to get. Pieces of shit. That's a oh god, a turret. Stay behind, stay Ooh. behind. Ooh. I know what to do, Dom. Stay back. Stay back, Dom. Stay back. Stay back, brother. Just stay back. I got this. I got this. I got this, brother. Yeah, you better go down. Provide me. Thank you. If, if I do that little ability where I down myself, right, and I'm, like, still alive. Yeah. I have like my I'm basically I have infinite ammo while that happens and I was using my nuke tubes so I can keep shooting like a rocket launcher. There we go. That's what I was doing. Oh fuck I'm gonna die. Fuck! Fuck! Ooh, Miggy! Oof. Stay back. Damn bro, I almost died, what the fuck? I bet. I almost died bro. I just hold Hey, get the melee on the car, bro. I put the. Yeah, I got you. Oh, 
Bulldozer. Kill that bulldozer. I mean, if you need it, of course. Yeah, I, t I took some. <gasps> oh no! Fuck. Oh, I have boy. to sacrifice myself. Hold up, Don. No! Brother. Ah. 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 Brother, thank you. Yes. I worked. Oh no! I love this jacket gun, dude. The camo makes it much better. I love this gun because of the camo. Yeah. There's a reason why I wanted this gun because of the camo. But then I found out you had to unlock and like gay, so I bought per got continental coins, and now I love it. It's the best gun in the game, to be honest. Yeah, but... Tony, no. And nobody gone die, gone custody, gone custody, die, hell no. No. I got him, I got him. I got him. Good job, let's go. He's called as a clown. Wow. Pick locking is faster now. Because of the skill. Yeah. Yeah, but. Nothing here, brother. Nothing here. Nah, you. Useless. Son of a You got it? Oh no. Thought you did. Not yet. Not yet. I'm getting shot at. So this is it. Please be it. Fuck. No, not it. I found one. Let's see, it's this one. Oh no, I need, I need your blood. I need your, I need blood. You got it. I got it. I got your back. It's probably that one for sure. It's not. What the fuck? Okay, it's okay. Let's move on upstairs. All right. It, mu it must be this one. It must be this one over here. Oh yeah, for sure. Yeah, it has, it has to be this one. There you are, you piece of shit. Oh shit, I didn't finish him. Oh yeah, our team has him. Yeah, yo. He's still alive? Welcome to the Air Dundle fucking gang. Yes, sir. Let's go. Okay.
It didn't do it. Epic. Epic niggas. My god. <laughs> Mm. Honestly, Tom, you know what we should do? What's up, Miggy? So look. So instead of claiming our rewards, let's just leave them and tomorrow we can continue from there. Sure. I, say, I think that'll work fine. I thought Dora would lose anything when we could. Yeah, but we can still continue it. Alright, so, yeah, alright. Let me see. Yeah, you can still continue, yeah, we can still continue, cool. Alright, mate. We well, have yourself a good day. Uh, a good night. <laughs>